The movie starts off with us being introduced to the main character, Tracy Turnblad. We see her going to school and she ends up going back home to watch the Corny Collins show with her best friend, Penny. The Corny Collins show is a teen dance show on Baltimore's TV network. Penny gets caught by her mom and goes home, not being allowed to watch TV. We see Tracy arguing with her mom about wanting to dance with the show because it's been her dream to perform. The next day after she comes home from school, she sees the TVs and sees the audition for the Courtney Collins show. She skips school in the morning to go audition for the show. And that's when we are introduced to Velma Bon Tussle, who is the TV manager for the Courtney Collins show. And we also meet Amber Von Tussle, which is her daughter and the lead dancer in the show. Also as well, the girlfriend of Link, the main dancer. When the audition is done, she runs back to school and is given a detention slip for being tardy. She goes to detention, and that's when she meets the ethnic students. The main ethnic student is named Seaweed. They end up dancing and having a good time. Link, who is walking by the room, sees Tracy, and they talk for a bit. When Link leaves, Tracy breaks into song about her love for him. We then see all the ethnic students and white students dancing on opposite sides at the dance event that the Courtney Collins show is hosting. Tracy ends up borrowing the dance from Seaweed and getting everyone's attention, including Corny's and Link as well, and ends up being selected to be on the Corny Collins show as the new girl. Velma gets mad though at Tracy for being selected to be on the show because she is plus size and the first thing that she says is that she wants every day to be Negro Day and Velma doesn't want her show to be integrated so she's going to do everything in her power to get her off the show for the rest of the movie. Tracy is now very popular in town for being on the show and she even gets a call for being so popular to be a spokesgirl for Mr. Pinky and chooses her mom to be her agent. The next day at school, Link defends Tracy from Amber's insult, and Tracy and Link go to detention together. In detention, Seaweed invites Tracy, Penny, and Link to a party on the other side of town where it is segregated. They end up going to the party by bus where they meet Seaweed's little sister named Little Inez. At the party, Tracy ends up getting caught by her mom, but Seaweed's mom, Mabel, persuades her to let Tracy stay, and she breaks the news that the special episode of the Corny Collins show where the only day that features people of color is being banned. We cut to the scene where Velma is trying to make Wilbur cheat on his wife, Emma. We get back to Tracy, and they all have decided to march to protest against Negro Day being canceled. And then we cut back again to Wilbur and Velma and Emma walking on to the sitting next to each other. But Wilbur isn't even aware about what is going on. But Emma gets upset and thinks he's cheating on her anyways. But Wilbur ends up apologizing to Emma, and she forgives him. Tracy ends up going to the protest, even though Edna warned her about being on list and files. The protest ends up getting stopped by the police. Tracy taps a police officer on the shoulder and things get violent. Edna tries and defends Tracy while telling her to run. Tracy runs to Penny's house to hide. Penny and Tracy end up getting caught by Penny's mom, Prudy. Eventually, Seaweed comes to rescue both of them and takes them to Maybell's for hiding. So Tracy and her friends end up planning to sneak Tracy back into the show so that she could prove a point to people on live television to show that Velma was wrong and that she was cheating and that she wasn't going down without a fight to really prove a point that she didn't do anything wrong. She was just trying to stand up for people who needed their voice to be heard. So Tracy ends up sneaking into the building and right before they announce who won from his teenage hairspray, Tracy enters and starts dancing with Link right in front of Amber. Then Link brings on Seaweed's sister Ines, who has always dreamed of dancing and singing on the Corny Collins show. After Ines has her moment and everyone else dances too, she ends up beating Amber and taking first place in the Miss Teenage Hairspray and resulting in the Corny Collins show finally being officially integrated. Finally, at last, Velma ends up getting fired off the show for trying to mess up the tallies for the competition, while Edna finally has her moment along with the other students and parents, both black and white, with a final dance together. The movie ends with everyone having a fun time and dancing, while Link and Tracy end up getting together. The end. But before I can really end this, I have to talk about how this really happens in real life. Racism has been going on for so many years and it's gotten to the point where our community needs to have a change. Because I've seen so many times where people have just been quiet 
or they have said something and they still get punished for it because of the way they looked or the way they acted or the way they danced or talked all because of their race racism is such a huge problem and this movie brings awareness how we need to come together as a community and fight for the rights of people of color and come together and be one we can't judge people off of their race anymore or their or any other thing that you can judge them for we all need to treat others as equals and treat everybody with equity and equality i think that's how hair spray is really coming across to a bunch of people and especially to our group and I hope that people have a different perspective after watching Hairspray and realize that something needs to be done about the racism in the world.